Welcome back to the Men of Victory weekly encouragement video. We just take a few minutes to encourage you to be the man of God that you're created to be. Man, I'm excited. <laughs> David Canfield back in the house. Number Thank, two. Number two for you. Yeah. Uh, you brought a powerful word last time, so I, I know today is going to be special for these guys. So uh, let me hear what you got for these guys. Right. Share your heart to these men. All right, this word was given to me, uh, the word resolve. Uh, last uh, March, right before the last return we went on together, okay. uh, didn't work out, I didn't have time to give it, but right. uh, God still put it on my heart to share with you guys. So the word resolve in the bio, uh, dictionary verse of it is to, to deal with successively, clear up, firm decision. Okay. So when I went on my return, uh, God, I'd been struggling with working at a factory life. I've always been in the factory. And seven days a week, 12 hour days, stealing from my family time. Right. And God just said, I got something better for you. And when I became free and get freedom, God gave me this, uh, uh, this job that we're in now. So he, he told me, I'm gonna have you start your own business. Right, yeah, and so that. Yeah, so we started an excavation business, snow removal firewood, you know, and, and uh, we started it part time. Mm -hmm. But he, he gave me this word resolve, meaning like, I gave you this word to go out into the world and start your business. Right. and give up what traditional jobs mean, you know, right. and uh, I will be their provider for you, so are you gonna do it? So I dealt with some fear with that because, uh, do I go now? Mm -hmm. Do I go later, you know? And uh, so sometimes God gives you a vision and some people just, oh, I'm going, I'm going all in. And right. uh, with me, it, it was a little struggle, but he just kept plugging away and saying, go, I told you to go, go now, resolve right. to go now. So uh, that was kind of my story. Um, so yeah, we, we got out of the return and uh, we used some uh, money out of our 401 and we started our own business. And, and that's kind of how that word resolve started in my life. So uh, in Joshua 1, 9, it says, count to the Lord whatever you do and he will establish your plans. Okay, good. Yeah, so, uh, and then he also gave me the word uh, Malachi 2.2, uh, which is kind of scary. So it, it talks <laughs> about if you do not listen and if you do not resolve, to honor my name, right. says the Lord Almighty, I will send a curse on you, and I will curse your blessings. Wow. And yes, I have already cursed them because you have not resolved to honor me. Yeah. So I was like, wow, you know, so. I, I, lo I love the, the word resolve because here's the thing for men, when we're, God's calling us to do something, he's always gonna back it up with the word. Yeah. He's always gonna put something in your heart, a word, because when trials and temptations come, like you probably had to even through mm -hmm. switching of jobs, you always held on to the word resolve. Yeah. I know that God spoke that because it was confirmed through pastors in your life, yeah. those people in your life, and you could hold on to that when it could get a little tough, yeah. and but holding on to God's word. So uh, kudos for just going after God for that word yeah. and him speaking that and then being um, obedient and having boldness in your life yeah. to say, no, this is what God's given me and this is what we're gonna yeah. do. So living that 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 Andrezo lifestyle, that mm -hmm. man of God lifestyle out. So yeah. well done. And, and the, the last thing that came to me through that was that our we went back to serve at the return, and I had fear about this. I was like, "What do I do? I'm I'm struggling with this." And you spoke that the spirit of fear upon me. So once I laid that spirit of fear down, I was like, "All right, resolve to do what God called you yep. to do." Absolutely. You know, and so I encourage you, men, when God's giving you a word or a vision, yep. go go yep. hard because yep. he, He's put that upon our life. So. Yep. Yep. So resolve, and, man. And hold on to it. Submit yeah. it, hold on to it, and just go through what God's got it for you. So, man, pray for these guys. Yes. Awesome work, dude. Yes. Thank you so much for this. Father God, we just uh, lift these mighty men up to you this week, Lord, um, that they have the resolve to do what you've called them to do every day, Lord. Give them the strength, the energy to just uh, be the men that you've called them to be. The freedom that they have from listening to you every day is just so peaceful in our lives. So. Um, I just thank you for this video, this teaching that we get to do every week to share life with you men, Lord. And uh, I am just so honored to be here. And I just pray blessings upon each and every one of you this week to go out there and capture what the Lord has for you. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Another powerful word from this guy to you guys. So give him a high five. Appreciate you loving my friend. Thank you. Um, and guys, we're going to have some more powerful words. So we'll see you guys next week for your weekly word of encouragement from the men of victory.